like a little man, but my goodness, he's really getting on my nerves. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Not My Bag. I'm George. And I'm Joe. And we've answered your prayers, ladies. You've been asking me, and we've got him. This is Sam from Love Island. Woo! Round of applause. We have a live studio audience here today. Basically, have the cast of Love Island All-Stars with us. Not All-Stars. No, just every Love Islander ever. So, <laughs> Sam, how are you? I'm all right. Not too bad. Not too bad. Not too bad. Yeah. How's things been after the villa for you? Um, to be honest with you, pretty normal. Like, the day I got back, I was in the salon that afternoon. Were but, you? Yeah, literally. Got back and uh, went straight to work. That was literally me. The public yeah. perception for you has been great though, hasn't it? Like, no, I feel like really everyone's good. really loved you and, and rooted for you. Everyone wanted you to go back in, didn't they, as well? Yeah. So, I mean, I think it was, that would have been really good if I obviously got the chance to go back in. Yeah. But yeah, I didn't really work We've, we've favor. really mugged it with these questions. I'm so sorry. It just says, what was the 24 hours in the villa like? <laughs> let's, call it, <laughs> let's call it 36. Let's, uh, that sounds better. 48. 48. 48. 72? <laughs> 100 hours in the villa. <laughs> no, what was it like though? Um, obviously... Short but sweet. Yeah, short and sweet, but like not a lot of people can say they've done it. And yeah. I think through... It doesn't really just start from the day you walk in. It obviously starts from like all the build up, like the months and stuff like that. Yeah. So it was just like, it was just mental. It was just crazy being there and actually like walking in there with everyone as well. Yeah. Um, yeah, it was just crazy, crazy. Did you day. get scouted or did you like apply for it? No. So what happened was... Um, I don't know if anyone saw when I was at work. Can't um, go through your front yeah. window. Wait, so is that, that how they found you? No, it was right. So um, <laughs> that was producer in the car. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> so what actually happened was that whole situation happened, and then ITV got in touch and was like, "We want to film it for Unbelievable Moments on camera." Okay. So then ITV came and then did like a whole thing. Right. Uh, and then the girl who was like working on that she was like i think you should really apply i think you do really really so well she was like so you were chatting up so from she, she, from she, yeah, like, pretty much looking. yeah. Um, <laughs> and i think she was like i think you should apply so literally like a couple of months went by and then she texts me saying oh everything's looking good blah blah she was like how are you how's things I was like, yeah just chilling really working mm. and then she was like fancy a date <laughs> yeah literally um and then she was like, i think you should apply so literally that night in my kitchen got my phone set up and you did tape. Yeah, I did all my tape, did it topless. I thought I'll have to do something to stand out. <laughs> um, so I was like, George Bags. <laughs> <laughs> she was like, literally on the phone, she was like, make sure you stand out. So I thought like, it's like... So you just whipped your cock out yeah, and literally. the rest is history. You know <laughs> that's I mean? around my kitchen. <laughs> um, but yeah, literally just from there. So like, that's all from... So what happened with the car driving through the window? Because like that, yeah, when you came out, that video then started like circulating. Yeah, because that was a year ago two days ago that yeah, happened. That's Everyone mental. was like, near-death experience. No, it was mental. Yeah, like, what, it, like, what happened? Like, our Barbara, one of our, like, clients, just literally, like, come round the corner and just, like, I'm not even joking. Like, literally. <laughs> can't park there, mate. You can't park there. there. She, honestly, like, she still comes in salon, she still comes <laughs> out. Yeah, yeah, but she cycles instead. <laughs> <laughs> she, um, no, but she still comes in now and it's, oh, it's just the funniest thing, like, when she comes in, like, Ooh, it's hilarious. You just stood there, innit? Yeah. Like, what what you you I, I was, like, more in, I couldn't actually understand what just happened. Yeah. Like, you know, and you just, like, stood there and a discovery's, like, in your face. <laughs> And you're halfway, no, through, really. and like, you're halfway happened. through like a fucking blow dry and you're just like, do you know what I mean? Yeah, what did you do? Did you just go back to like, cutting hair after that? No. Uh, it was like, as I like, no, as oh, I no, swept away the, the hair. Oh no, so it was her prom, bless her. Oh, yeah. Shit. And she was what like, day. I was there like, like oh, you're all right, love. <laughs> like, you're fine. Like, <laughs> Shut up to glass. Oh, no, she's at the prom oh. like, yeah, yeah, great no, day. Literally, so like, <laughs> we got her out and then literally just had to clean all the salon up. Like, fucking it was an intense day and then we got all the window fixed and everything in and then two days after the window got fixed the car literally to... just missed it where the fuck is this salon what on a roundabout <laughs> no it's literally <laughs> like it's, when you're there you actually can't understand how it even works yeah but then it got even worse one of my clients come in and she's holding the door open she went how did that silly twat do that and the woman sat <gasps> getting her nails done. And I looked, <laughs> I was stood at reception like this, and I was like, she's like, what a silly twat. How can you do that? And I was like, I just didn't say anything. She said anything. You are? Did, did the woman who- Oh no, she I mean, to be all. fair, she, it was a bit silly. You just have to sit there and just take oh, it, mate, you know? So, but like my client did that and I was- Imagine you joining in. Yeah, what a dumb- So back to the <laughs> villa. 
when you were in there, like, I know it was a short amount of time. Have you come out, like, formed friendships with anyone that's been dumped? Like, obviously, Moonveer's come out since, yeah, Ronnie, yeah, yeah. people like that. Have you stayed in contact with people? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Everyone, really. Uh, me and Monveer, like, we speak every day, to be honest. Um, it was just a shame, like, it was so short. Yeah. I want to know like, one thing. Okay. Let's get fucking into it. Go on. Do you think you've been done dirty? I think you have. 100%. There we go. I think... How Flip that shit. I do. <laughs> Let him speak, sorry. I do think I did get done massively dirty. Yeah. And, but I think as I was out, like how I am and stuff like that, I'm glad it happened to me, no other person. Yeah. Right. yeah. I, just, I just don't think someone would have handled it the way I handled it. Yeah, yeah. You've like you've taken it on your it, chin, like... but the, yeah, it's like, because it was quite a harsh thing to then bring in an already like existing personality yeah yeah because sam when samantha came on she also said like she felt like her experience was a bit tainted by do you know what i mean by by joey and what yeah. happened so i feel yeah. like though it's because they want the most out of the show so they're like who can we bring in like they want to try and get as many people in and cause as much shit but i mean but like, i think you deserve the fair yeah, chance I, I, we were hoping than... that you were coming back in in like casa you know yeah yeah yeah, um, yeah. It's a shame, but you're still doing really well. So yeah, since you know leaving, I mean? have you had any like DMs from any any famous people and that? We might as well just ask. Any famous people? Um, you know? um, no, not really, but oh. definitely um, yeah. the DMs are very very busy. When yeah. I started to get the DMs, like get him on the pod, I thought this man's DMs must be insane. Yeah, it know? was insane. Like I got it's that. So when I got back to the UK, they gave me my phone back. And I didn't open it for like five hours. Right. So like, obviously you jump in a you jump in an Uber, you go home and stuff like that. But the funny thing is, none of my family are at home. Right. So all my family was away. So I got back to an empty house. The first thing I did was literally like <laughs> sit there and cry. <laughs> literally got back, empty house. First thing I did was go. Didn't even have any milk in the fridge to get make a cup of tea, which I was fuming about. So I went to shop, got right. milk, and then got to the till. And this woman was looking at me. She went, "Were you on my telly last night?" I was like. No, I don't think so, love. And she's like, you look really familiar. <laughs> and then, yeah, I, I literally like turn my phone on and I just, it just, yeah, it was crazy. But I was like, I just didn't want to turn it on, to be honest. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Was there I've... anyone like when you were in there, um, was there anyone you had your eye on or you think like, look, what, like, have you watching it since you've come out? Like you're watching the series? Yeah, I'm keeping up yeah, to date with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So is there anyone that you think you would have like coupled up with or wanted to get to know in there at the minute? Right now? Yeah. Um... <laughs> Sorry, Sorry, we've we, got we've got Scott. We've got a crawl. live audience. <laughs> and, and he's we, crawling. And we've got Scott crawling along the floor. <laughs> um, I would say either Uma or Grace. Uma or Grace? Yeah. I mean, Grace is just another level. Yeah. I actually think you'd be quite well suited to Grace, to be fair. How do you spell it? George isn't actually watching this series. Grace looks kind of like your girlfriend, so I feel like you would like Grace from Love Island. No, I like my girlfriend, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. Moving on. <laughs> Swiftly. Moving on. Thank you, Joe. Um, well, we feel like you were done dirty, so we wanted to bring you on to surprise you and have some fun. Yeah. Are you ready to have some fun? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Why don't you kick it off, George? Um, so we thought we'd give you a little speed dare. We've got three dates. Is yeah. this Sheffield? Close. Three, three dates. Close. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What am I talking like? Barnsley, isn't Barnsley. it? Barnsley. They all sound the same. Do it. No, they don't. No, they we're don't. we're no, picking no. three dates. Oh. Is that? No? Right. I've got one thumbs up and one. Oh, okay. I'll Come just on. speak normally. Anyway, we've got your three dates and we thought we'd do a speed date. Me and Joe are going to jump in. <laughs> So we've got these so, bad boys. So basically, we've got three okay, islanders. I thought here. I was explaining. Yeah, I'll just do it a little bit more, a little bit more deep. <sighs> three islanders, yeah. Right. And you're gonna, we've got some questions for you to ask them. And it's we're gonna though. give you our opinion. We've got some buzzers here. And at the end, you get to stand on this set and say who you're gonna couple up with because you didn't get to do it in the villa. So right. we thought you're gonna do it here. Sound. How you feeling? <laughs> buzzing, mate. Are you buzzing? <laughs> Let's get you a date. Whoa, this is a massive we're round of applause. We're with Abby. <laughs> Woo! How are you, my love? I'm good. How are you? Good, thank you. Thanks for coming back on. Thanks for having it's me. It's your first time on the new set as well, <laughs> I know, isn't it? I know, it's love. I know, thank you. Thank you. Okay. So for those at home, why don't you introduce yourself, like what series and all, all that jazz? Okay, so I'm Abby. I was on season 10 of Love Island. Um, You're a bombshell, yeah. weren't you? No, everyone thinks I was a bombshell. I was Casa Girl. Oh, Casa Girl. Yeah, Casa, so you got yourself a Casa Girl. Slake Come on. Come on. You guys are quite well matched, you know. You think? 
I'm liking the fringe. Yeah. Oh, you? Yeah. I've yeah. got the fringe and you've got the mullet, so yeah, exactly. kind of go now. Yeah, 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 it balances out. Oh, yeah. And he's a hairdresser, you see. Yeah, you know, I cut this at the train station today. Did you actually? Yeah. No way. Yeah, is it quite good? Oh, no, really? <laughs> It's not bad, it's not bad. Okay. Not bad. Right. right, well, we'll, we'll chemistry, <laughs> chemistry's electric already, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Right, Sam, take it away, first first one. So, what's your best pickup line? I'm not going to lie, I, I do not pick up boys. You I know. don't go in and do the so, pick up So, line. what would it be, like, uh, uh, girl, <laughs> sorry, um, I don't they come to me, <laughs> what would it well, be? Well, they don't actually, that's the problem. <laughs> <laughs> um, what would it okay but what would it be if you saw lovely Sam at the bar like Aww. okay like oh, how long have you had your mullet for <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm rubbish I don't know picture this you've that. just driven into his shop window right yeah. you're yeah. wheeling the window down <laughs> no, and you're going to say something to him what are you going to say um Sapling boy, right? <laughs> that yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad. What would you say back to that? I'm still single. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Go away. <laughs> I'll probably say something about doing her hair, you know. In, in what capacity? <laughs> probably like um I feel like sometimes with an insult you've got you've got to have a little you've got to have like a tiny little insult and then like cover it up with a pickup line. Right, go Slightly. on then. Give it a go. I think I think probably say something like um Act like you're at the bar just talking to someone. Would you would, would you, you do, talk to someone you, like this? Do you go up to go? <laughs> Before last honestly, Do you go up to go, isn't it? Yeah. One time a girl was at the bar and then literally because the kills would like not even brush out, I went behind her and brushed them out on my hands. Oh that's nice. <laughs> Did you? No, no, it's it's really Fuck you right. touching my hair and I was like, love, I'm not being funny, but that way. No, I'd love that. I'd be like, oh thank you. Let me get my hair brush. Oh. <laughs> okay, fine. So so round one we've got what's happening, man, boy. What's happening? Boy. What's happening? What's happening, boy, you're right. What's, what's happening, girl? Right. 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 Okay, what's fine. Boy, you're so right. that would be your like yeah, pickup line. I'd probably love that because it's like it's nothing serious. It's funny. Okay, I mean, fine. it's funny. Breaking the ice. I, I feel like, like nowadays, it. but now it's funny. If someone done that like originally before it was a thing, you'd be like, what's going on? But now when people do it, I actually think it's quite Yeah, yeah, I agree. It's a bit long. <laughs> Such a <laughs> 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 Your love oh my language God, is tough. Brilliant. Yeah, defo. Yeah. 100%. Your love language. What's your love language? Yeah, same, like physical touch. Okay, yeah. right. So yeah. you've got a match. <laughs> okay, it's definitely, like, it's definitely um, physical touch, eye contact. Do you know what I mean? Okay. I think, mm. I think they go a long way. Yeah. Definitely. Okay. Right. Well, what's the next question on your list? Um. So what would you say your top three icks are? Right. I've got the ex. Oh, God. You know when... So this is one now, so watch yourself. When a guy's sitting on a stool and their legs are, like, dangling off oh, the stool. Fuck. You know? Yeah. Well, sorry, I am. <laughs> <laughs> I can't help that. Sorry. Um, yeah, it's just really icky, isn't it? You know, yeah. just, like, dangling there. Um, paper train ticket. Paper train what? ticket? What? Oh, I so feel that. Oh. I get that 100%. It's such an ick. Yeah. But when they're, like... Yeah. <laughs> How can you help a fucking paper train ticket? <laughs> yeah, like, get the and train line out. You know the worst thing, like when they're getting in their wallet, I'm to get me a ticket out. I agree with you, right? Because That's it's ridiculous. when like they're fiddling around to get it in the, the slot oh, and yeah, then yeah. it comes back up in the game. And they don't know if it's going to come up or not. And they're like, and then they and walk it into come, it. And, like, <laughs> and then you walk into the barrier. And yeah. Then they're like, <laughs> yeah, I completely agree. That's a valid it. That's yeah. That's What's your third end. one? Oh, the third. I don't really know. Let me look. What's wrong with you? <laughs> <laughs> but this is giving like chemistry, next, you know? Uh, next, no, I'm joking. Next time. Um, no, I'm joking. Tattoos are gentle. Tattoos are gentle. Well. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> we, have, we, have, we have Mitch in the audience. That's why I'm streaming all night. Well, well. We have Mitch of a next tat. A next oh, tat. God. Okay, or um, if a guy sits with like their legs crossed. You know, like on the floor, or, like at school. What, like, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, true. Not like at school. So you've got a thing for <laughs> legs. <laughs> It seems. Oh, yeah. Dangly yeah. legs. So no dangly legs. legs. No, no dangly legs. legs. Paper tickets. No paper tickets. So yeah. what I'm getting. I had no crossing legs. <laughs> so yeah. you want a Next steak. question. Wait, wait, actually, I want to know your ex though. Is that my ex? Okay. Yeah. My top. I would say picky eater. I think oh, when someone's nice. picky with the food, I'm just like, it's just an ick. Okay. Don't yeah. just eat it. Chicken and chips. <laughs> that is that is chicken that. and a can of coke. Yeah, do you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, I would say, and then girls riding bikes. <laughs> George, let the man really? speak. Let the man speak. Girls riding bikes. That's what my two sisters do. <laughs> 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 
sorry. Sorry, sorry. Carry on, Karen. It's not my date. Oh, Jake, leave the man alone. Oh, sorry, carry on. Getting really invested into this. Um, picky Ian. Picky Ian. Bad hair, I'll be honest. I'm one of those. You know, like... I feel like, it's, like it's got to be done with you. It's you know? got to be... You know, yeah, like... Yeah, you know, she's got bad and hair, and split ends, not taking care of themselves, not brushing yeah, it. How the ends? Yeah, they're, yeah, they're okay. yeah. not bad. Yeah, they're not bad. Yeah. Yeah. Check them out already. Yeah. Um, and then <laughs> I would say... Most people say people have loads of it. I don't really have that many icks. I'm pretty easy going. No, but like your the ick would be like someone who has a bit. <laughs> yeah, true. 100%. No, when a girl was like this. this the most yeah. ick I've this ever is heard, it. right, was what Patsy said when she was like, "When you love your mum too much." Oh, next. Or something like oh, that. like mummy's boy. I would <laughs> say, I would say Stop. there is a thing with men, and that what? And you like, ring mum every day. <laughs> no, that's not an ick to myself. If I was looking for that in a guy, because I know a lot of my girl mates are like. It's giving like your mum wants to shag you. What? Right. Have you never heard this? <laughs> no, I know what you mean. Have you, do you know what I mean? I know like, what that like, means. Like, no, like, I know what you mean. It's a, girl, it's a girl's thing. It's when thing. the mum can be like, really protective. As and well. it's like, why and then are you, you so that, protective yeah. over your it's son? Cool. He's, yeah. like, he's 25. I'll just hate my mum. You know? Do you know what I mean? No, but no. What, do you want? <laughs> what do you want? You no. want someone who like gets on with their mum really well. Yeah. And they're like good, but not like. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I just thought of me. I just thought of it what? when you've got when you're seeing a girl and you know like they have a best friend but they always have to be like together together or on the phone to each other yeah. always, do you know what I'm saying you know what like that is like one of those things I'm like why can't you do anything by yourself yeah yeah do you know what I mean like I don't want your best mate I want you yeah exactly yeah that's quite nice but do you know what I mean? I'm not a lone wolf. I'm like a pack animal. So oh, I, really? I wander around in a pack. Yeah. Okay, in a pack. One of the <laughs> one of the massive icks that I hear flying about is guys having baths. Oh it yeah! Is, like yeah, sorry, I just won't yeah. wash. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, but how, you, you don't feel it's clean sit, after look, a bath. Do you know what it is? It's sitting in the bath like a boy sitting in the bath, just touch yeah. it and just sat there. Like, also, waiting. I'm gonna, like, I'm gonna add to this. Just, I'm gonna add to this. No bubbles. Yeah. Okay, that's weird. Yeah, but who has like, a bath? That's just like you're, flying about. Yeah, you're just, yeah, you're just that's it. In, in scummy water. Yeah, visualizing that. No, Your thing just sat there and floating. Oh, oh, right. Enough of X. Um, what's what's your like dream first date? Dream first date. Like, where could you be? Where could you imagine it? Like, are you chill? Like, look, let's grab some in and in the car and go for drive, or let take me to fucking Nobo. Do you know like, what I mean? It's gotta be something active for me. Mm, on the own. Cutting like, air. Do you yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah, it has yeah. to be activity. Because I'm like no sitting, no. <laughs> it was like, give me a fringe. No. <laughs> 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 I was okay, saying, come go get some scissors and cut it up. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, definitely something active. It has to be like like go karting or like go karting, go yeah. eight, yeah, go eight, yeah. yeah. Okay. Like that. trampoline Ooh. park. Yeah, I'm back to I'm I'm seeing seeing a lot of spa. Oh my god, I haven't done that. I really want to do it's that. Mint. It's mint. So good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. It's really good. Do that. So it has to be like that. Or when you go to a restaurant, I think it's so. I can't. I think if when you sat at a restaurant on a first date and you're sat across from each other, it's just intimidating. Yeah. So I can't like do that thing when you're yeah. sat next to each other yeah. and you're eating. I don't like that. Like I always want to sit like on the corner. Yeah, yeah. You have yeah. To yeah. Sat next to each other yeah. And okay. I'm getting compatibility. Well, I can't here. lie. If you guys choose each other at the end of this, then we will pay for you to go to go A. Yeah, let's do it. That'll be it. will be going on wow. the business account. This, uh, <laughs> this, 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 this wasn't agreed before, but um, right. we'll sort well, something that, out. That's basically, it's gone like, right. it's gone that's right. basically three rounds. So how do you guys think that went? Yeah. How good. Yeah. Well, yeah. Well. What does the studio Bye. audience think? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. This is the most bizarre, like <laughs> surreal situation. Right, well, I feel like we didn't really buzz in and say criticize much. I think that went quite well from our just side. Girls, didn't just it? girls on bikes. Just, just girls on bikes. Just girls on bikes. Well, I'll let George go. Yeah. Right anyway. So yeah. we'll bring in the next date. Thank you so much, Thank Abby. You. And we'll yeah. see you at the end. Thank you. Let's have a little debrief from El Samuel. Samuel. Mm -hmm. How did we find that? Good. Yeah, really good. I thought it was good. Yeah, I thought it was good. Yeah. I like so, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like it had a lot in common. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Good good chemistry. Do you know what I mean? Compatibility vibe. Yeah, absolutely definitely. love that. Well, let's bring in your next day. We have Diamante from Casa Amor this year. Please bring her right Casa Amor. <laughs> Hi, my lovely. How are Hi. you? Oh, thank you. I'm Hello. good. How are you? I'm good, thank you. You've been dating nonstop at the minute from <laughs> Casa to here. Literally, I've been so busy. <laughs> Booked a visit. You excited? I am. 
yeah. You're excited to get to know our Sam. Yeah. Our Sam. Are you excited, Sam? I'm, I'm buzzing. Mm. <laughs> what's your top three aches? Um, I'm very like, um, what's the word? Tolerant. So okay. I don't. I wouldn't really say I have aches, but I'd say here's a list. <laughs> 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 no, my if I had to say an ick, it would be like um. Oh my gosh, I actually don't, I don't think I have any ears. This sure? is good though. It, Candyman? This is, this is, <laughs> yeah, because, I mean. Candyman? Yeah, I'd say that's Nick. Yeah. <laughs> maybe, maybe like, because, maybe a guy that like leads on and then doesn't stick to their words, you know? Yeah. Because you were just. Someone who doesn't stick to their words, I'd say that's, that is the only ick. Backtracks. Yeah. yeah, who backtracks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like you can't say something and then just not stand on it. You want to make it. There's nothing worse than saying something in the moment and then like the next day you go, well, I, yeah, I'm, yeah. Uh, I don't really 100%, mean it. A hundred percent. Yeah. Okay. Fine. What? So, yeah, we've got we've got your ex. Can you're you quite. Think? So wait, I'm just getting from this. You're quite easy going. Yeah. You just you just want you just want a, you want a man. Yeah. Someone who's gonna stick to their word. Yeah. Okay, Sam. I can go with that. Yeah. Definitely. I'm one <laughs> Are of those, you that man? Possibly, because possibly. I'm very like I just say how it is. I don't really like bullshit. bullshit. Yeah, yeah. Literally, like I just say how it is. Say it in the moment and don't really like. Okay. Go back on it, if that makes sense. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I'm definitely straight up. Yeah. So what's your love languages? My love languages. You seem so interested. You're like... <laughs> now. Well, he's on a die. He means this. <laughs> My love languages would be like acts of service, I'd say. Like, you know, breakfast in the morning. Even though mm -hmm. I don't really eat breakfast, but it's like okay. maybe lunch. Um, <laughs> lunch is, he like, is he like doing something what... To say if like... Is he more doing something what... You don't need to ask for. So it's okay. So I was, it's like if I say something on like Monday and you remember it and do it on a Thursday, that's like wow to yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah. That's hard. Okay. Can yeah. you buy me some toothpaste? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> no, I feel that. I feel it's, that. It's a little thing. Okay. So it's actually, it's usually interested though. When someone yeah. does that, something like that. Yeah, it's always like they things. pay attention. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. But acts of service can go a bit crazy sometimes where people are like, girls are like, fly me out or like, you know, like. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, we won't be doing that. Yeah. <laughs> so is, there like a, is it like smaller acts of service as in like the breakfast and stuff like that? Yeah, like or, if you're going to the shop or something, mm. just like bring me back like a meal deal or something. Fine. Or a bag of sweets. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Too soon. Little things like that. <laughs> <laughs> I was lit. Too soon. In my head, I was thinking the exact same thing. Too soon. Too soon. Okay. Sorry, fine. Fine. For acts of service. Are you quite a touchy person? I am. I am very affectionate. As okay. Well. That's like, how Sam's I like thing, doing so. that, that picking spots thing. Um, <laughs> no, that's the thing. Lauren it loves is a doing thing. that thing. Okay, like Sharon, she's like, oh, my back. Do you, do you like that? I ain't gonna lie. Don't do it. <laughs> Don't do it. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Wait, what happened? Um, we woke up this morning and had a massive spot. He, had a massive, he squeezed the spot on your back. back. Yeah. I couldn't get here. And he was happy to pop it as well. Yeah, but you know when it's like looking at it. Okay, that's compatibility right there. <laughs> do you know what I mean? Popping each other's spots. But I see the spots. First slide. date. <laughs> do you know what I mean? That's my worst nightmare. Do you not like popping spots? No. Really? I, I do it like by myself, really, unless it's on my back. I mean... <laughs> you have to do it. No one else yeah. I was in the shower for ages and I couldn't get back to it. But that, 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 it, it was bad, that one, really? though. Was it? Yeah. Yeah, is there, is there a spot that's too big that you just wouldn't touch? Or do you just oh, like pop and... Oh, no, oh, the oh, better. Is <laughs> do we, what level? Is it abscess? Do we, like, <laughs> are we talking boil? Yeah. Oh my God. Is it colour? <laughs> <laughs> no, because I'm doing a bit queasy. I'm very easily, easy, easy queasy. I, I literally love watching like the TikToks of people doing it. And like when they like... Like pimple poppers? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, <that> was... <laughs> These two are weird. You're telling me but you've never watched like one of those blackhead videos. Yeah, and I press yeah. not interested. Really? Oh, yeah. right. oh my gosh. Disgusting. I actually go on the page and I'm like, wow. Oh my god. Are you both into skincare? Because you both got quite good skin. I don't have any skincare, me. Neither. You joking? <laughs> never. What is in that Love Island water? Because. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not <gonna> saying. <laughs> <laughs> so, so not really skincare girlies. I don't know. No. I've never used anything on mine. Except for just a bit of beard oil, that's it. That no moisturizer. No. You're just raw dogging everyday life. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> that's crazy. Yeah, I love that. I think sometimes skincare oil. makes your skin worse. Do you think? Like I'm I'm yeah. literally convinced. Because I've never used anything. I've never had an issue. Right. Well, 
Ideal first, first date. First date, yeah. What's that going to be? Oh, who wants to start? Go on, you first. My ideal first date. Um, do you know what? I think there's nothing wrong with an activity. Okay. You know, like something fun. Like I literally saw someone the other day. They went to... um. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I was literally gonna say that. Like, go wait, they've gone to go do some like zip line and everything. I okay. think that would be quite fun. Is there something where, say, if we went on a date and I was like, I'm not telling you what we're doing, we got there and I was like, this, and you would be like, I'm going back grateful. in the car. But like, is there something what is you'd there be like, something? absolutely not? Yeah, like scuba diving or. Shark no. Shark cage. Shark cage. <laughs> yeah, yeah, shark cage is a no no. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no Everything else is a yes. Yeah. No. There's not a lot of them in Sheffield or something. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I don't God. even know where Sheffield is. Yeah. How dare you? I'm gonna say. <laughs> what What would be like your dream holiday to go on? Dubai. Okay, oh, a Dubai, Dubai girly. girly. A Dubai mm. girly. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay, we've had a disagreement. Why don't you like Dubai? I, I mean, or what's your preference? My preference. Miami. <laughs> cockles in Sheffield. <laughs> <laughs> Do they have cockles? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Is there a seaside in Sheffield? No. no. Oh <laughs> my god. <laughs> Yeah, oh, yeah, oh, you mean. To like, you know, it's near the sea. You can go. Oh, it's not near the sea. So what if oh, Sam yeah. wanted to take you to Hull? Oh, uh, hang on a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Dubai or Hull? Hull. <laughs> <laughs> mm, Imagine. Fun. No, because there's a thing like obviously where I used to live there. Okay. Where it's like it's just like Dubai is home from home. Home to me. So it's just like I've like I've got friends there and yeah, everything. Yeah. Okay. So it's just like that's always like my first choice of holiday. Yeah. But yeah, I feel like I do need to explore the UK more as well because there's a lot of like hidden gems. I think we all do, yeah. did you live there for then? One year. Is it? Because mm -hmm. I used to live in Australia. Did you actually? Yeah, so I lived there for a Was year. Was it good? Oh, amazing. I love Miami. No. <laughs> what? <laughs> what happened in Miami? Sam, like Miami? Sam loves Miami. I love Miami. Really? Yeah. Why? It's, the, it's just the place to be. Like the parties, the weather. Mm. Yeah. Oh, it's giving red flag if you ask me. <laughs> For parties. <laughs> that is why, you know, when we did the lineup thing at the start, Love Island, that's why I was so low. Oh. Because we were talking about like traveling, they're like, you travel too much. Like, that's why you put, that's why they put me so low. Oh. I was like, how does that make any sense? Travel too much. I know. It's a random one. Uh, we also didn't do the um, chat up line. So, just quickly, what would your chat up line be? Take me to Dubai. <laughs> I or do you have a usual, do you, have you ever like gone up to a guy and pursued them or is it typically like they come to you? It's typically they come to me, but obviously I do like to like give a bit of like eye contact, okay. and show that I'm interested. You yeah. Know what I mean? And that's kind of like the eye contact is like the go ahead. Okay. I think that's the, I think when you're out and about, if a girl looks you and there's eye contact like a couple of times, right? Yeah. Right, that is your sign to go up and talk to them. Okay. About just any random well, shit. So you just got you get the eye contact, you go up, you sort her hair out. I think, yeah, literally, like, like flick it about a bit. Oh, um, oh, <laughs> oh <laughs> good hell! We've got children here. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. No, I do I just think like I think every guy would agree, like if you are in if you're in a bar or something like that, if you make eye contact with someone like more than three times, yeah. Go over. Call you. the police. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's like a call the police or shag them in the toilet. I hear it. Well, thank you so I think much. This, was a good date. this I think that this was a good day. <laughs> I think this was a good start, you know. So, like um, yeah, no, thank you so much for coming on. And we'll see we might see you at the end. Yeah. <laughs> Big round of applause, guys. <laughs> right. Okay. Please welcome on Ruby. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Looking, looking stunned. Why don't you, you introduce yourself for the people Hi, at I'm home? Yeah, I'm 23 and I'm from Surrey. Woo! <laughs> that was my cringiest thing I had to do out of the whole program. What? Introduce oh, yourself. The 23 and from Surrey, yeah. Oh, well, you look, you look gorgeous. Thanks for coming on. So Thank you've you. just been on Casa, yep. got back, mm -hmm. and you had a thing with Sean, didn't you, as mm -hmm. well? Yeah, that's you why. You've had a thing with Sean? Yeah. Is it? Yeah. That's why we thought yeah. justice for Ruby yeah, justice and justice for Sam, him. bring yeah. you on together. <laughs> I think already you look quite well suited, to be fair. Yeah. What'd have you, you think? heard that apparently if you look like siblings, you're compatible? Wait, what? Have oh. you heard that? Has oh. no one, have you heard that? Check your hard drive. Uh, <laughs> check your hard drive. Come on, Check your history. If you look like, not related, obviously, weirdly, but if you look like siblings, apparently you're compatible. I do agree with this because a lot of people getting engaged on my timeline at the minute Literally from like school, I'm like, you are cousins. Yeah, you look yeah. like. Siblings are dating, innit? What do you think they look alike? 
No. Not really. Yeah, no. there was a whole page. Siblings all dating. Yeah. And no one could tell. Yeah. I think it's, it must be just the hair and the like darker features probably. Well, like, have I got a mullet? No. <laughs> Actually, let's do a, let's, I was going to say let's do a hair review because Sam loves to do a hair. Oh no, oh, definitely. Half of mine nah, isn't I'll only mine. check that out. Okay, cool. Half, yeah, of, yeah, mine half <laughs> of mine isn't mine. Half of mine isn't mine. Jokes. Yeah, that looks good. That yeah, looks stunning. Thank you. It's good. Really nice. Okay, okay. last well, Let's start with the chat up line. What would you say to, to Sam if you saw him at bar? I don't have a chat up line. No, I've I never, don't think I've anyone never, does now. I've never used one, and I think I've taught all my girls this, and it's just the stare. It's the across the bar oh. and. It. If you like someone, there's a couple of steps. Give them a little up and down look, shows the interest. Mm -hmm. Walk by, give them a little 30 seconds there. And then go to the bar, have no intention of buying a drink. Okay. And, and they then, will follow. But will you look at them again? Yeah, at the bar. But so like, that's three stairs? Yeah, yeah. Three, the three steps there. The three steps stairs. It is, it works, but it works it. every <laughs> single time. No, like, it does work, it does work. Uh, that works on you? It does. Oh, 100%. I'm confused about the second step of the stairs because the so, 30 seconds seems a bit like at the bar. No, like. it's, it's, no, it's, no, it's not like a... I would think it's I'm interested. No, it's a little bit of a... It's a flirty, like, look away and you know if they're interested because they're already staring, waiting for you to stare back. Okay. I'm not going to lie. The first look up and down, I'd be like, you rude bitch. <laughs> no, <laughs> not, like a, not like a, what are you doing here? It's just like oh, a little right, bit of okay. a check you out. They okay. look you up and down. It always works. Let's make that clear next. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, hop to it. Hop to it, spit on that thing. <laughs> so you're, out. You're both into staring. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you're both into staring. You're, you're both, both into staring. staring. Um, oh, just don't go cross-eyed while you do it. Yeah, 100%. Good, yeah. good tip. So, in terms of icks. Mm. Oh. oh. How, many, how, how, how long you got? No, mine's, mine's only like a couple of things, but it's like, if they do this, is it a no-go? I, I can't okay. date someone. So jeans. When a boy's when a when a boy wears oh, boy, tight jeans. tight jeans. Okay, do, you're, do you know like when they're like sculpted, like, oh, like spray on jeans? Tight jeans, white jeans, That's or fair. ripped jeans. That's fair. Like, and I don't mean just a little rip. I mean so any you know, it looks like they've no. been in a war with a bear. Which, wait, I'm coughing. So you got tight jeans. <laughs> That's him. Yeah. He, I ain't like, he's hard dress. He really Order! Hard dress. Just, so what was it? Skinny jeans? I just feel like it's so. Easy for a man to dress nicely, and like, why would you walk into a shop and think, yeah, they're spray on white nice jeans, small. white jeans on a man, oh. cream jeans, baggy, fine, and white chinos, jeans. What chinos about? Like old man chinos, Cog like the really oh, yeah, straight yeah, okay, leg yeah, ones. Yeah, yeah. Like, I don't know what day, men you're no. going for though, because I don't go for them. That's what I'm saying. Oh, right. <laughs> but that's when you're out and you see them, or if the jean is like here and the shoe starts here, and, and they've got like, an ankle. <gasps> what a no stop, <laughs> and no, no stop. stop, just pure just ankle. Just to tip it off, you look and you go, that is barefoot in that shoe. Mm. That is neat. They could be it's ankle smelly shoes. Yeah, <laughs> smelly shoe. <laughs> smelly shoe. But yeah, jeans. What is my other one? Nails, long okay. fingernails. Dirty fingernails, yeah, like yeah. get a scrubbing brush, get a okay. nail clipper. What you've got, really... you got working man hands. I'll be honest, my don't my mind, nail, don't my mind rough hands. Ruined from colour. Don't mind rough hands. Oh. The the ruined, to be honest. <laughs> okay. Like, they're purple. They, they look scruffy, but they're not dirty. Yeah, but it's just that's hair one dye. thing. If they was actually dirty, like you've gone out and you look like you haven't had a wash, <laughs> like thick mud or long, that I can't stand I that. It. Okay. I, not, I don't want a well-groomed man. I just want someone who looks like I, I don't now. like long nails on a man. I no. just want to say... That's one of them. It, or like, you know what I always... My pet hate is when someone's like thumb, their nails oh. like real... I don't... What, I, half a nail? Yeah. Mm. From what we've what heard... thumbs? No, like yeah, when they bit all their nail off, it's like half oh, a nail. Oh, no, because there was a girl at my school that had toe thumbs. Megan Fox. What do you mean? Megan Fox has Megan toe Fox. thumbs. What Megan is Fox a toe thumb? It's basically Google like... Google Megan Fox's thumbs and you will... I want to Google Megan Fox. It's like, they're, like, they're, like, they're like that. They're like Are half they? a thumb. It's like half a thumb and not... Yeah. Eh? Yeah. It... Megan Fox. Oh, it's terrible. No. <laughs> Told you. Oh, yeah. What? Oh, you would never have known. <laughs> what is that? I don't get you... it. It's just basically, it, it resembles oh, a big right. toe. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, I, I did want to say though, out of all the icks we've had so far, these are probably the most normal. No, they are. You just I want agree. a normal person. It's, just not, it's so hard to find these days. No, I hear it. Like, it's cool. Um, <laughs> but last one is a liar. And I don't even mean like in a relationship. Like, I mean... Compulsive. You'll be having a conversation. They're just, you know, and you're thinking, oh, I can I, I can know this isn't true. Like, yeah. why mm. are you even running And they're just this? thinking about sweets. Can we have an example? <sighs> like... <laughs> 
Yeah, so I've, I've fought a bear before. Yeah, like just Dan, random Dan, stuff. Turn, fucking run at me. Like, yeah, but I only know it's a lie. Because you can just tell. Well, no one would fight a bear. But you know, no, my, obviously my not. Favorite but like, thing, I meant lies. My favourite thing when someone does it and they're such a compulsive liar, my ex used to do it and he'd get so caught up in the lie and he'd just keep going and going and I'd go, this is going to end. This didn't happen. And he'd just keep going and going with okay. it. Okay. So a liar. Yeah. So a liar. Just fingernails. unnecessarily lying. Liar fingernails jeans. Are you any of those? A liar. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Scott. Oh, oh, God. Yeah. yeah. It's all about the club promoter in Miami. <laughs> <laughs> um, I only have the fingernail. I think the fingernails, yeah, because mine are just ruined. Okay. Mm. That's the only thing I would say. Yeah. Grafter, though. Do you know yeah, what I mean? that's okay. okay. If it's like permanent dye, that's acceptable. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Win him. So, ideal first dates situation. I think a first date, they've got to pull all the stops out. It's got you. They've got to show they're interested. Okay. Show how much they actually are thinking of and trying to impress you. So a nice restaurant hasn't got to be expensive, expensive, just somewhere nice. And they show you attention. They haven't got their phone on the table. Thought behind it. The thought that goes into it. Yeah. And nothing too pressure. Like... Just chill, just get into know right. each other. Not a cinema where you can't talk. Oh, oh it works. I hate the fucking worst. I don't worst understand. First dates. Why would you go to the cinema? I think yeah, first movie. dates like when if you go to the cinema, it's like a safety thing because mm. then if you, you meet at the talk. beginning yeah. and you're not too yeah. sure about them. Because I'll be honest, some of my mates are like, oh, I'm meeting this such and such, like, I'm not too sure about it. I was like, oh, go, on, go cinema. Because if it's like, talk to her. If the first hour is not it, look if the first hour's not it, at least you can go cinema and then go home. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? It's a rough one, isn't it? Yeah. I don't no. never get why people do it. But no, def definitely a restaurant. And then everyone's always nervous on a first date. Have a glass of wine. Mm. You chill out. Or five. Talk, you talk rubbish. <laughs> don't have five because, you know, the <laughs> night goes wrong. But chill out, get to know each other, talk rubbish. Okay. And then, you know, if it goes well, you go to a bar after, have a couple more drinks, or you go home. Right. I, I think it. it's, a, it's a good way to get to know each other. <laughs> I was going to say. <laughs> With him or someone else. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. Um, so I've got a question. So would you ever go back with someone after a first date? No. You mean like stay the night? Yeah. No. <clears throat> Sir. Yeah, but, yeah. Would you? Hey, yo. Uh, hey, yo. I think personally, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I always think like if literally if the I don't know. I'm one of those. If the vibes there, the vibes there, and the chemistry's there, why not? We're in it. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, I'm no. one of those. I sometimes think right playing devil's advocate to the mm. whole. You know when you're like you don't want to go in too fast too soon. You have to suss someone out, like, in that way, physically. Like, getting in their pants? Is that what you're trying to no, say? No, what I'm trying to say is, like, it's, it's, like, it's, it's, one of those, it's, it's one of those things that I always think, I know this sounds, this sounds really bad, but, like, imagine if you went on a date with someone, like, <laughs> hold it. <laughs> like, imagine if you went on a date with someone, like, I don't know, four times, three times, mm. and, like, the chat's all good there, like, and stuff like that, but then... Will the sexual chemistry be like be there? Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, like, is it going to fizzle out? Yeah. Like, if you're going, if you're going, on, if you're going to restaurants and, and you're sat there talking, so far, is the sexual is it, tension? I think what go? you mean, like, is yeah, it just like you're talking? Like, oh, I don't know. Like, <laughs> but if you go first date and the chemistry's there, like, while you're swinging around trees and go ape, do you know what I mean? And, like, <laughs> do you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> It might carry on into the bedroom. Right. You know what okay. I mean? So you, what you're saying is a woman on a zip wire turns you on. Maybe. <laughs> you sick motherfucker. <laughs> um, on a swing. Okay, fine. I hear it though. I get both points. You know what I'm saying? I understand both sides. It's like, what, I think what you're trying to say is after like four or five dates, you've been chatting great weather, but is it just chatting almost like it's just really good friends or... Is that what you're trying to say? Yeah, a lot. Imagine if, like, after, say, you know, you have eight dates and then you end up sleeping with them and the sex is not really, like, there. Like, it's not, you've like, just wasted eight dates. Yeah. Not wasted. It's not like, wasted, <laughs> but, like... <laughs> so, sorry, I was... We're, like... <laughs> no, 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 I'm trying to be really tentative and polite. Yeah. I've, okay. just, I've just got to get to know someone. Like, I just can't... I don't know. I've got to know someone well, and I've got to have that like bond. No, that's it's, fair. It's, it's I, yeah, no one yeah. I do yeah, feel yeah. that. Like that. But sometimes you bond with people a lot faster. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Six hours. So okay, I'll counter this. And what's your ideal second date? Some people will do the Sex. first. 
<laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, oh some people go straight to a Netflix and chill on the second date. They'll like be no. like, come over. So is that a no go for? I think you? second date's really good. Like, come over, cook, nice food, <laughs> blah blah. blah. Yeah, you what? You what do you mean? I can cook. I'm a rake. I'm a rake cook. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm a rake cook. <laughs> Okay. And I am. I think come over, super chill, glass of wine, cook dinner. Next thing you know, you're naked. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Steady on, not yet. <laughs> I don't know. I think that's nice. Some, I think more chilled on the second day than the first day. Yeah, but then you've gone from good expectations here and it's like, yeah, we're just going to cook and watch a film. That's still that's right. I think that's something you do once you're over the honeymoon period. You're really like, right. you're settled right. in and it's like, how Babe, long? we don't need to go out tonight. We enjoy each other's company. Like okay. you know, a month or two in, when you've how that long's honeymoon, the honeymoon stage for you. As long as it, as long as it. Sometimes it can last a week, and you're like, I'm sick of them. Get rid of them. Sometimes you're two months in. You're like, I love their energy. Just want to be with them. That is your honeymoon period. So two months. What's your? Yeah. <laughs> Mine's normally like eight. Eight months. Yeah. Like eight eight months, months honeymoon what, period. When you just yeah. can't get enough of each month. other. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that is a good honeymoon period. That's yeah. Do you know what I mean? And then normally after that. It, Nothing really happens after that, I don't really sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> but I'm <God>. single. <laughs> so what's so what would be your like dream holiday to go with your partner? Dream holiday of a partner. I'm quite an adventurous person, so Ooh. I Please, I've no always wanted to go to Jamaica. <laughs> go where? No, 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 go away. Go away. no, no, not like that. I mean, I mean, like, I've always wanted to go to Jamaica, like white beaches. That's cool. You can sightsee while you're out there, but enjoy each other's company, sit on a beach with a cocktail. Okay, nice. I love Ooh. that. Nice. Jamaica. Yeah. N Miami, ever tickled your fancy? No. <laughs> oh. No. Will Smith over it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh. I'm... <sighs> Apart from Miami, yeah, where we, could you see yourself going to Jamaica? Oh, 100 percent. Something like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. 100 percent. Um, Island hopping. No, not, most, no, most... I hate city holidays. I like a mm. beach holiday. Same. Yeah. Wales. Yeah. Wales. Absolutely <laughs> not. <laughs> would, would you go backpacking together? That's a good question. I don't know. No. Would you not do that? I'm an overpacker. No. There'd be like three suitcases being trailed round. Bears. Bears. Okay. Yeah. Would you I, do I it? I couldn't do it. Backpacking. Yeah. Oh, 100 percent Yeah. I think it's more like it's just like not knowing what's going to happen. I think that's what's exciting. Okay. I'm very last minute with my trips. Like, right. it's Mom, literally... guess what? I've been robbed. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's so exciting. <laughs> no, like, I'm, I'm so last minute. Like all my trips have happened. Oh. Like the best trips I've ever been on uh, always happen like last minute. Okay. Fine like either I, get a, either I get a phone call and then I fly out three days later. All right. So uh, one of them. Right now. Well, yeah. I can't do last minute. Why? Oh. I mean, I can do last minute, but I've got to have some oh. sort, at least a good 24 oh. hours. I can't. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> I can't. Oh, no, Why though? Know what? Because I'm such a, I need all my stuff. Like I overpack. Like I'll be going away for a weekend. I'll take ten outfits just in case. I get you. I'm like that too. Like, I'm like that too. I'm like to. two pairs of boxers, one pair no, of socks, t-shirt. That's my worst this, nightmare. This skinny jeans, <laughs> white jeans, that's for sure. <laughs> no, this date's been very interesting though because at the start there was a lot of things like yeah, yeah. get that like the ick's like fair, yeah. and then you've said a few things and you're both like. But you're Wait, like what? yin and yang, and sometimes yeah. that's good. Yeah. To yeah. not be too Opposite similar. Track. Yeah. yeah definitely. Okay, we've learned a lot. Thank you so very much for coming guys. on. It's lovely to see you, and um, we might see you at the end. So oh. Give it up for Ruben. Ruben. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you. Well, what do you think of that one? Let's, yeah, nice. Let's debrief. Yeah, lovely. Lovely. Yeah. Um, yeah, a bit different, but it definitely went well. Have we done well with the lineup? I think so, yeah. Yeah? Yeah, 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 definitely. Yeah. Is Come there on. anyone tickling your fancy? Um... Possibly. Okay. 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 Well, we'll take a quick breather and then come back with a decision. <laughs> oh, yeah, Welcome back. We brought in some of the live studio audience. We have Messy Mitch and Scott, who's done about a billion Love Islands. So come on. <laughs> These ones do as well. We've got five between us. <laughs> this isn't about, this isn't oh, about me. That is crazy, about to be yeah. fair. Uh, to give some advice on how you think the dates went and who you think Sam should choose. After you. Oh, I, uh, I like the middle one with... Um, Diamante. Yeah. Is that how, is, is that how yeah, yeah. I Yeah, yeah. Um, I felt like they got on really, really well. Okay. I felt like Sam was himself. Everyone on Love Island didn't really get a chance to see him because he was only on 24 hours. But from what we know of him, <laughs> he's a bit mad. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's fair. And if them two go to Go Ape, as long as they don't kill each other, then... They'll be fine. Be we are funding day, the Go yeah. Ape trip, everyone. Yeah, so apparently. it will happen. It will happen. Okay, cool. Okay. 
Mitch. At <laughs> <laughs> the same time, Hi, Mitch. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. There's no mess here. Listen, I... <laughs> No, I said no mess. No there mess. is always not, mess. There's that. We're always mess. Um, I think Ruby, you know. Okay. I do, do you know what it were? There were tension there. Like there was egos bouncing off each other. Tiny, but I, I like that. A bit of, a bit of toxic. Yeah, but he said there. something. Ruby said something different and then he changed what he said. Oh. So that means you like her? Yeah, oh. yeah. You're, you're adapting. You're adapting. I've always said that I'll never ever go for another Ruby. Oh. Why? Have you oh. been with a Ruby oh. before? Ruby oh. before. You've been for, or is that a sister name? No, it's one of those things. I haven't had a good uh, track record with a Ruby. Really? Yeah. We we had a dog called Ruby. and then we, I didn't. We did. Who remember? did you have a dog called Ruby? We had a childhood dog called Ruby and mum and dad gave it away. I always thought he was adopted. <laughs> anyway. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, so <laughs> what, watching it, did you, did you back your boy though? I did. Yeah. I knew it. as soon as I found out from Sheffield, I was just biased. Like, this guy's going to win. Yeah. I love him. He's the best thing ever. And then it, then I was literally out on a Saturday night. Mum rang me like, Sam's, Sam's left. <laughs> I went, you're letting Sheffield down. <laughs> I was yeah. gutted though. Like, stunning boy. Am I wrong? He's a very good looking guy. And I expected better from you. I'm very disappointed you actually. I hate you. It was just a shame, weren't it? Really? Yeah. Yeah. So you're on the pole now, like properly. Like, obviously you're out in London this weekend. What's the plan? Just have a laugh. Get some. Of, Are you, you know, going to take out just, one of the one of the dates today? Maybe, maybe. Yeah. But just have a laugh. Really, I'm just trying to enjoy everything. Yeah, try yeah. and go home with them on the first date. We're sharing. We're sharing a hotel room, so that will not be happening. Oh, you're sharing a hotel room. Uh, yeah, last look, night was eventful. <laughs> yeah, like spot popping. Your face mask and that. Face oh, mask. No, I, 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 I convinced them the hotel was haunted. And they, no, they, don't they, get the started on that. <laughs> the kettle rat. Can I just confirm that <laughs> it is haunted? But then he just took it to a, a different level. I made up a fake news story. <laughs> so something happened with the kettle. <laughs> the kettle randomly came on. I made up a fake news story. Yeah, that was horrible. The, Spirits connect with whoever new guests in the room no, <laughs> through the cat in room too. And I've sent, I've, I've made it up, screenshot it, sent it into the little group chat. They're yeah. reading it. He's got his bags packed, ready to oh, go. Oh, literally, I was packed. Shoes were he's on. A, he's about to drive three hours home to Sheffield at twelve o'clock at night. Really? And I'm sat in the corner pissing myself. Can I just clarify something though? Like we got there, and <laughs> the woman there, we were saying like, oh. Yeah. It is haunted. Oh, I told her to say that as well, by the way. Did you actually? Yeah, <laughs> swear to God. Did no, you actually? Did. I told her to say no, that. No, you bar. didn't. I, I hate this. God. I swear to God. You're I swear lying. to God. She was too. No, no. I, I swear it. to God, at the bar, I told her to say the room was haunted. Right. Can I just clarify something? <laughs> <laughs> if, that, if that is actually true, that's mental. Because then he was like telling us a story. We sat there and he was like, oh, someone died on the first level. That's what he said. Right. When he said that, the kettle turned on. Yeah, it actually did. It literally way. flicked on and then it flicked on. the video. The, okay. Yeah, then we, then we literally, it flicked on. I've got it on my Snapchat and then and then we paused and I watched it flick back off and that would be set. Well, then you know gone. how a kettle, when you turn it on, the light comes on. <laughs> yeah. On the flick. And then he was like, shut up. And then he was turning it on and off and the light, light was coming on. on. And it switched off. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> well, ghost hunt on your first date. That was what I was thinking. Ladies. Do any of the ghost girls hunt. like a ghost hunt? London Dungeons and shit. Girls, oh, can you hear us in there? Ghost Abbey's down Any of you like ghost, ghost hunting? <laughs> oh, right. see, Dear Monte, okay, there we go. A go ape or a ghost hunt. There right. we go. Thank you guys so much. And we will wait and see who Sam is going to choose. Ruby. I reckon Ruby's the one. Listen, trust me, my track record... Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> I know, I know. No, listen, listen. I have a girlfriend and I'm very happy. So my track record, when I put my mind to it, putting my mind to it. Ruby, are you interested? <laughs> At all, by any chance. Are you, are you interested in Sam? Oh, oh, exactly. oh. she's here. There we are. Right, okay, let's right. get the verdict. Oh, right, let's get the verdict. So it's verdict time. I ain't fought yet. Can oh, we? Sorry, all... Gee, like, right, bloody hell. Sex, sorry. Oh. Right, right, I want to, let's have one good thing from <coughs> each date that stood out to you. Let's start with Abby. Um, Abby, I would, <laughs> um, I would say she seems a bit more relaxed and goes with the flow a little bit more. Okay. I would say, I think she gives off that little bit of a vibe. Okay. I would say. Okay, cool. And then. Diamante. I would, um, I feel like I would have to do a lot more to impress her. Okay. I would say. I, would I think, say. I feel like the Dubai thing threw you. <laughs> she said <laughs> Dubai. <laughs> yeah, the Dubai thing, I was a bit like, <laughs> but. What do they say? Adapt, overcome. And that's what. Adapt, 
Adapt, bear grills, improvise, exactly. overcome. Not Bear grills. Is that do Bear grills say bear that? Grill? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, we'll just say it's Scott's. <laughs> Scott. Scott saying. We'll just say that's Scott saying. Um, yeah. Okay. And then Ruby. Scares me. Oh. She's just. <laughs> <laughs> she nearly fell off her chair. She just collapsed. She nearly fell off her chair. What do you mean? She just terrifies me. In what way? She scares me. Strong, yeah. independent woman. Yeah, terrifies me. Fair. Do you know what I mean? I hear it. Fuck it out. I feel like she would like manhandle me. Ruby <laughs> said <laughs> that. <laughs> <laughs> she'd manhandle me I feel like she's a strong independent woman yeah that's what I just um, said <laughs> anyway I'm trying to collect my thoughts let's let's just let's get straight into okay. it you've had time you've had the dates who Samuel do you want to couple up with or not my bag <laughs> okay. I would like to couple up with this girl because she's funny, intelligent, quite easygoing. Um, and I do think we're on the same page with a lot of things. Um, but she has shocked me a little bit, to be honest. I didn't expect her to be like this. So, okay. But the girl I would like to couple up with is... Abby. Oh! Oh, oh, oh. oh, Abby, congratulations. Come on in. Come on in. Come on in. Finally. Oh. That was no, no, because as soon as you got I didn't realize as soon as you sat down, I was literally about to say that word for word. <laughs> Oh, oh wait! I've just, I've just realized. I've just too. Oh, I love that. I was about to say that one line as well. And by the way, I love it how the boys just didn't mention my name once. <laughs> They're like, oh, don't, just don't talk about her. <laughs> oh, no, babe, no, babe, no, babe. There's still feelings. Like, okay. Given there's still feelings. <laughs> um, how are you feeling, Abby? Oh no, yeah, good. I'm happy. Go on, eat, yeah. Hello, I'm yeah, okay, okay, cool. cool. This is actually happening. And you're both going to the same party tonight. So, yeah. yeah. You know, who knows? You might be staring at each other across the bar. Yeah, a couple yeah. of Yeah. Do you know what we didn't say? The triangle. You know, when you go like, you look at the, do you know that triangle face? The triangle face. I, yeah, yeah, that's it. <laughs> exactly like that. You look at the triangle. What's, the, tri you what's the triangle? Where you look at a guy and you like, look. To the eye and the lips, and like you do the triangle. Oh, yeah, I'm in love. It's the, it's the oh, yeah. You know what I mean. Don't I know you? exactly what you yeah. mean, Sam. Yeah. The flowers. The flowers. Oh, <coughs> the flowers. Oh. oh. He's going to fall off the chair. Oh, my Jesus Christ. I was like, this chair's going to break. He's going to fall off the chair. Got me to get them. <laughs> oh, Woo! he's a gentleman. <laughs> well, this is the first time that we've done oh, this. Oh, thank you. Finding love on the pod, <laughs> and it's been a roller coaster. Um, thank you both so much, and also thank you everyone in the studio. We've got the two girls at the back. Our, our yeah, audience, Ruby, thank, thank you, you, so thank you so much. You too. Thank you. It's been got. It's been a whirlwind. It's been a lot. It's felt like literally like after sun, isn't it? Yep. That's how it's felt. Yeah. <laughs> um, and it's been a roller coaster. But we made it. But if you guys want to see us have it again. Let, not, maybe not with Sam. I hope you guys do that. <laughs> yeah. Go, the, again. Full, go the full <laughs> way. Um, let us know in the comments what you thought. And thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe. Obviously, five stars on Spotify. It helps us massively. That is us for this week. Thank you, everyone. Let's have a round of applause. <laughs> See you next week. That's a wrap. <laughs>